guys, Rocco here. We've got a special request for the Honest Trailer for Chennai Express. Let's have a look. See how she goes. Yeah. Rohit Shetty, a name synonymous with color. Ajay Devgan, Looney Tune Physics, and Michael Bay Explosions. <laughs> moves in a different direction with a personal story about finding oneself with breathtaking visuals and heartfelt relationships. <laughs> yeah, it's still Rohit Shetty. <laughs> Shahrukh Khan stars as... Rahul. My name is Rahul. Hey. Rahul. Hi. Rahul. 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 Because that joke is new. <laughs> and featuring Deepika Padukone as a Malayali sounding chameleon. Rahul ends up on the Chennai Express for a ride that will forever alter his voice, eh? totally normal life. As a nincompoop nitwit sweet seller out of a putty who can fight like James Bond but cowards behind women like a sidekick. <laughs> Logic, you ask? Why doesn't Rahul just tell his grandma I'll buy from the house? Rahul's rich. Why not just fly to Madurai, take a taxi to Ramesh, let him drop off the ashes and fly <laughs> to Goa? Why not just leave the ashes on the shelf for a week and visit Ramesh where later? Do these ashes have a disurgent by date? Why is Deepika's character running to get on a train that's heading back to her father's village? Why doesn't this guy block Rahul's vehicle instead of driving past him, leaving him open to this totally realistic depiction <laughs> of Newton's laws? Answer, Rohit Shetty. But it's not all bad. The main song will have you wanting to take the Chennai Express all right off of a bridge. But as with most Bollywood movies, there's that one song that deserves its place. Seriously, it's good music. Is it too much to ask for a screenwriter who can pen a script as good so that this one music video isn't surrounded by two and a half hours of phoning it in? Now you may be saying you're just being too picky, but are you going to argue with me when the final line of the film is? <laughs> I'd call that phoning it in. Shuru Khan does still have some dance moves, unlike some other guys we know. I'm sorry, can we all agree that this is not a dance move? <laughs> or this? Or this? Rohit Shetty's eye for color lighting <laughs> and framing is actually really good. I'm actually being serious. And some of the scenery work and cinematography is really eye-catching. Although the establishing shots do just keep going. <laughs> what is this, Lord of the Rings? My daughter's actual reaction. Okay, we did it. <laughs> There's a waterfall in a tree. A beautiful one. Okay. And then there's this one. It's Disney. Something familiar about this. Oh, that's right. No way. Why use this? <laughs> Rohit Shetty. Featuring the Nokia Lumia 920. Sharuk, take it away. Nokia Lumia 920. Advanced floating lens technology, fat boy pillow recharge, wireless recharging docking station, High quality audio in retro styling, rupees 34,249. Cool guys don't look at explosions. <laughs> Bad boys. Camera tricks. Whoa, whoa, whoa there, Shetty. The token muscular mangator who has a change of heart at the end. Don't they all? The stand on top of glass shot. What is it with this thing all of a sudden? <laughs> One of the most blatantly patronizing dance sequences in recent memory with giant cardboard Rudvi Kant avatars to appeal to the Tamil demographic and Yo-Yo Honey Singh to appeal to the douchebag demographic <laughs> and the most realistic depictions of village life since Peeply Live. What? Your village doesn't look like it's fresh out of Kung Fu Panda with a Ferris wheel and a chlorine water Ferris lake? Wheel. Oh wait, here's a tractor. Now it's a village. <laughs> and of course, slapstick cartoon sound effects. I mean, this is actually a pretty good joke. <laughs> Until you go insulting your audience with the audio equivalent of an applause sign. <laughs> because Rohit Shetty. What should we holly bolly next? We totally know. Because you've all said the same thing. Maybe next week. Just don't let Ude Chopra know, please. <laughs> holly bolly is not affiliated with Screen Junkies, but we figured they're probably not turning their eyes to Bollywood anytime soon. If we were wrong in that assumption, Screen Junkies, please just let us know. In the meantime, We'll advertise for you guys. And, uh, in the meantime, you can just not sue us or something. Tell me something. <laughs> that was good. I. Eh? Oh man. That was good. That was a good. Uh, has he done any more of them? Oh, Chris Three. Yeah, I definitely want to see the movies before I watch the parody trailer, just so I've got a bit more knowledge into what it was. But yeah, that was wicked. He's got definitely got the, uh, the movie trailer voice. That's that was cool. Yeah, thanks for recommending that one, guys. And uh, yeah, any other ones out there you need us to have a look at? Drop a line in the comments. Cheers. Remember, hit like, subscribe.
See you for the next one. All right. <laughs> And that was it. In the 90s, we ended on the fucking kiss. <laughs> yeah, that's a classic. That's a good one.